Hi, my name is Eric Latender, and I'm author of the book, The Amazing Dog Training Man. And I want to thank you for watching today's video newsletter. A lot of times when I'm dealing with dog owners, I talk about the importance of exercise. And a lot of times, the dog's behavior problems are the direct result of the dog having too much pent-up energy. Dogs do nothing that they were bred for today. <laughs> Most dogs that were bred to herd and hunt and guard, a lot of them come into our households and they don't do anything close to that. So what we got to do is we got to make sure we give them other outlets, let them use their brains, give them enough physical exercise. So I'm a big believer in using dog daycares, pet sitters, pet walkers, those types of services. Really helps out our dog. And the better you are at giving your dog mental and physical stimulation, the easier it is for your dog to live with you. At a recent seminar, I talked a little bit more in depth about this, and you can watch it in this next part. Good. He's not that good. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, but one of the things that Caesar's really good about is exercising the dogs. He, like, that's his thing when it comes to dealing with the dog behavior problem, is he exercises them like crazy. puts them on actually um, treadmills. treadmills, yeah, and he just keeps them moving. And the thing is, is that he's right to a certain degree because dogs, um, a lot of times when I go to somebody's house, I'll take one look at the situation and I can tell that the dog is having all these problems because they have so much pent up energy. You know, dogs that are just digging up the yard, dogs that are chewing, you know, just crazy, dogs that are barking all the time, is that the dog is just bored and they're trying to relieve that boredom by doing these different behaviors. And a lot of times when you give the dog enough exercise, about 85% of the behavior problems that I see go out the window. I started a dog daycare in uh, 19, August of 1995. And the reason I started it was because I had a client who had a Dalmatian. The dog did great with all his obedience. Sit down, stay in, stay, walk on the leash. The dog was phenomenal. But the dog was making the owner crazy because this Dalmatian was loaded with energy. And so I trained at night and during the day I had a big place like this, even bigger, and uh, it was just a big open room. So I started bringing my dogs. I said, hey, drop your dog off for the day. I'll let him just play with my dogs all day long. And that's what we did. It's his Dalmatian played with my dogs all day. He picked up the dog, brought it home. He did this a few times. At the end of the week, he came up to me and he said, what are you doing with my dog? So you can see why exercise is so important. Make sure you give your dog enough exercise. And as I said, it's going to be easier for you to live with your dog and your dog to live with you. Always remember, the only good dog is a tired dog. Thanks for watching today's video newsletter. And if you have any questions, feel free to email eric at amazingdogtrainingman.com and have a great day.